Let's look at skinning in Music B. If I go to my main menu and go to select skin, we have various different skin categories that we can choose from. The default skin is the Music B3 skin, which looks like this. You can also choose the Windows theme. When you change a skin, Music B will need to restart. And we now have the Windows skin, which makes Music B look more like a Windows window. If I go back to select skin, I can go back to Music B3. We can choose a random skin or look through these categories. For example, blue, dark, dark fine tune. And as you can see, there's many different themes, sub themes under these categories. Let's choose Nordic. See what that looks like. Many themes have different splash screens as well. And we see here we now have the Nordic theme. Which when we play a song, notice how the bar at the bottom changes to match the artwork. Not all skins support this though. If you have the menu on the title bar like this, like I do, you can also go to View, Skins, and it brings up that same menu. I'll choose the Midnight Metro, which is my favorite dark skin, which looks like this. If we bring up the Edit Preferences window, you also notice that all the Windows for Music B will take the same theme. If you go back to your skins menu, you can choose to add a skin. And you're going to need to look for the XML file for your skin or zip. You can also go to find more skins which will open your browser and take you to the website where you can download more skins. For example, we have the Void Dark skin here, the Dracula skin, and more. And as you can see, there's many different skin options. I'm going to download this one. We can see here a preview of what it looks like. and go to download. This is a zip file, so we'll go ahead and download that. And in our music B, we'll bring up the skins menu, go to add skin, and select the file. Music B will restart, and now we can select the skin. And notice that this skin has various options with it as well. So we'll select it. Allow Music B to restart. And here we go. This one looks really nice. I'm going to download another skin. Let's download the Dracula skin. I want to see what that looks like. So again, we'll go to the theme, the skin. We'll go to download and download. Notice that this is an XML file, so we will download that. Go back to Music B. Go to Add Skin and select the XML C file. Music B will restart once again. And here we go. Some skins can be customized. Those that are of XML format can be directly modified. If we go to our Music B folder under Skins, and I'll look for the Metro Style XML. If we right click and edit, we can see all the elements in their color. It's formatted by Element ID, Background Color, and Foreground Color. You notice that the menu bar default has a color of 10, 10, 10. The foreground color is 240 across. 
And we see here all the other elements in their color codes. You can even create skins. Here's a skinning guide for Music B. And it explains the different elements, what they are, and how to correctly code them. I have a link of this page in the description below. And so that's a look at skinning in Music Bee.